Carter, you gotta... No, let's, that's let's, what we have to do, Ryan. I don't want to do this, but you've leave, literally left me guys with no choice. You guys are acting like children out here, doing literally illegal activity. Um, what is... No, just, okay, like, I'm, I'm done with this. I have a lot of stuff to do to finish this house up. You guys need to go. She's definitely here. Hopefully she even opens the door. Yeah, I know. What's up, dude? Yo. You guys have, like, 10, 15 minutes. And then we gotta go? Okay, thank you. Appreciate it. All right, y'all, so we only have like 15, 20 minutes to talk about all this. As you can tell from the title of this video, whatever that's gonna be, a lot just happened today. Um, Liz is being nice enough to let us use her studio for maybe 15, 20 minutes, and then she's, we gotta get out of here. So, uh, you gonna, you gonna talk? Uh, we should just do yeah, it. Yeah, Let's just do it. Yes. Yeah. All right. So basically, a ton of wild stuff has been going on lately, and I, the only way we can properly explain what happened is to go from the beginning. Mm -hmm. From the very beginning. From where... the very beginning. Well, it all started with... It all started when my mom had me at Cayuga Medical Center in Ithaca, New York in 1996, March 15th. Okay, so the only way that we can really explain to you what's been going on, we can explain these circumstances, is to go from the beginning. We're gonna kind of go through everything real quick, and then we'll update you with what's happening right now. Let's say a month ago, month and a half ago. Yeah, about a month ago. It all started with uh, Carter's Lambo got spray painted. It's brand new, brand basically new. a super nice car, right? Yeah, Lamborghini, brand new. He just got, it's like $400,000 or whatever. Somebody came in, spray painted it. There was security footage of it. Carter did his own investigating and he accused myself, uh, Stove, and then a few other members of Team RAR, that's kind of our group. And instead of, you know, approaching us and sitting us down, he made a YouTube video about it and then made a video of him retaliating and spray painting my car, which uh, is, he like completely destroyed. Sakara! Carter, what the <laughs> You actually, yeah, you, you got a bunch of paint right there, it's so easy. Why would you? At the time, Carter didn't really show us the raw footage. We only knew what we saw on YouTube. Yeah, we were trying to find out what really happened. So he went back to his place. He didn't really want us around, so we kind of snuck back in without him knowing. It was a whole thing. Mm -hmm. We didn't really learn much from that. We did find footage of who spray painted the car. I can put that on screen right now. Basically, it's a figure. Black hoodie, black pants, black hat, can't see anything. So then basically he kept making videos about the fact that it was us. People started blaming us for doing it. I know it wasn't so, he knows it wasn't me. It's just, it doesn't make sense. So eventually we were done with the whole situation and we went back over and we were actually this time going to play like a joke on him. And, and spray like spray paint ourselves. And, and actually do, but when we got there. I'm like, hold on. Hold on, this is already open though. It's a blank. Shit, shit, it's it. a blank canvas. It is sideways. If you want to. Oh, hold on. What's this? The yeah. timing was ridiculous. Carter comes out as soon as I see what happened or what's on the Lambo, which was R2. And so basically, someone got there and spray painted before, before us. Before us. Like right before us, probably. What the heck's going on? The hey, what are you guys doing? Whoa! Dude, we just, Ryan, dude, 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 we just got here. We literally just got here. What are you guys Carter, doing? Carter, we just got here. Are you serious? My no, 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 no. You're that, holding the paint right now. What do you mean, no? We, we, no, we just, just got, got here. Yeah, we, you just I didn't just finish the paint it. job. No, we were, I literally Stove just wanted, Stove wanted to spray paint your car, but we didn't. We just Yeah, no it. kidding. You, I, no, you did spray paint my car. We did not it's spray right paint your car. It's right there. But obviously, in his eyes, he's like seeing me with spray, you know, spray paint cans. He got really mad at us. In his eyes, it, I totally understand why he got mad. Like, we wanted to defend ourselves, and obviously we tried to, right? But in his eyes, we were caught effectively red-handed yeah. for something we didn't do. Like, dude, I'm gonna call the no, cops on you guys. Just get out. Leave. Dude, just no, leave. That, I'm, I climb I the know. fence. Climb the fence like you guys did to get here, and just get out. This is ridiculous, dude. This, you guys are not my friends if you guys are coming back to spray paint my car like this again. Since then. Things have been super awkward. We haven't really been talking. We haven't really been filming together. I think the most conversations we've had have been like over text a few times. This whole thing is just kind of got out of hand very quickly. And oh, so quickly. We're just, we were just trying to clear our names because we didn't do it. We know we didn't do it. So yeah. we're just trying to prove that we didn't do it. Then from there, story progresses a little bit. We uh, went back to the house one night just to again, try to find some more info because obviously this person, this culprit, this vandal, whatever you want to call them, the person who's like vandalizing the cars, returned to the scene of the crime at least twice. We found footage of the second time they showed up. They were literally there moments before us. 
we found out that they are someone who can get in, get out. They must know the layout. They must be able to climb the fence really easily. There's even a really sketchy, sketchy clip of, um, in one of his videos, we in the background sneaking away on the top of like a building. It's just crazy how everything's just unfolding. Like friendships are basically just online. It, it, yeah, that's the hardest part. We've been friends for a long time. Being a part of Team Raw is a huge deal to us. Like we helped build it up. We helped make it, right? So we are, I feel like we're core pillars of this team. Yeah. But what happened is the other day we ended up going back, seeing the person in the house. Look. Hey! Hey! Stop! Boys. We tried to tell Carter, and the, he all he heard in that conversation was that we, without his permission and against what he wanted us to do, we went back to the house like a fourth time, which yeah. got him really mad. I'm over this, guys. Like I'm done. I can't. I can't be doing this anymore. I gotta go. All right. Dude, oh. I guess that kind of leads into what we're talking about today. Basically. We got a text from Carter. We thought he was gonna to want to film or talk to us about something, so we went over and uh, I guess I can just play the clip here. Yeah. We had a big conversation with him. So yeah, here it is. <laughs> We're back again, baby. Here you go, right here. I the, wonder, do, do you know what he's- Dude, the gate's wide open. Do you know why he texted you think? Nah, I think he just wants to film a vid. You wanna hit, you wanna do the door, door knob, doorbell? I don't know, I'm kinda, it still works. Well, he's not even here. Oh. Hey! What's up, what's up man? All right, let's go. Come on inside. Okay, what's up? What are you doing with your camera? Just filming around. We're filming, man? What's going on, dude? No, we're not filming right now. That's not what this is. Put that down. Turn it off. Turn it off? Yeah, no, don't record this. Turn your camera's off? Like, seriously, I don't, right. want, I don't want to see this on YouTube. Like, don't be filming this stuff. What's up? All right, um, we need to talk. Okay. You know, like, we're not filming today. That's not what this is. I know you guys are like running around content, but you guys have been just like out of control. With what? With what? From all kinds of stuff. You guys were like spray painting cars, lying about it, making videos. No, we You're, told you it wasn't us. Though. I saw, I walked on you guys spray painting. I literally walked in on your stove. You were holding a can, spray painting my car first, the second time. I don't know who did it the first time. I saw you guys the second time, 100%. So I don't know what you guys are doing. You guys keep looking for this evidence. Okay, well then find it then. Find it or don't, but it's clearly you guys are a part Dude, of this. Dude, we tried to tell you the other night. We had clues, we found clues. We FaceTimed you the other day. No, it's just, you we came back. Yeah, we came it's back. great to make YouTube videos and it's fun, but at the end of the day, you guys are painting cars. You're not being honest about stuff. You snuck into this house. This is like empty. I'm cleaning up like the last couple of things. We have new tenants coming in. Like this is done. This is not the team our house. We're not filming here. You guys have snuck in more than one time. I've been looking at your YouTube videos. Like, I told you we cannot be here. This is not our house. We can't film here legally. We don't have, this is not, like, we don't own this house. It's not, okay, dude, like, the team of our house. Like, this is being painted today. That's why I'm here. The painters are coming. This will be gone. Like, this is not the team of our house. That's another chapter that's in the future. But, like, this isn't team Rar anymore. And you guys aren't either. You guys are not acting team Rar. Like, the stuff that you guys are doing, the stuff that you're putting out there is just, like, not good. You guys are breaking the rules. You're going against what I'm saying. You're just like messing stuff up. Dude, we're just trying to prove to you that we didn't mess with your camera. Oh, you guys are just running rampage with your cameras and posting videos and all this kind of stuff. It's not reasonable, it's ridiculous. And honestly, I, you guys are gonna get yourself into trouble. You guys could have gotten arrested every single time that you've been on this property without permission. That's Dude. trespassing, we don't own it. It's like snaking into the neighbor's house. They can call the cops, you guys could be in jail right now. And you've done that multiple times. You've also done it with other properties in the area too. Like, it's not okay, you can't be doing that. We're just trying to clear our names, like to no. There's let nothing you know. to clear. What do you mean? Like I got the car fixed the first time. Okay, great. You guys came back and spray painted again for what? For a video? Like that doesn't make sense. Put the cameras down. Stop trespassing, breaking the law, and stop trying to get yourselves arrested. As of now, you guys are off the team, dude. No, as of now today, cameras down, channels gone. Like stop making content. You guys are no longer on Team Roar. I can't be doing this. You guys are not acting like Team Roar. You guys are not acting like my friends. You guys are lucky. You guys aren't in jail right now. For all the trespassing you've been doing. We can't keep doing this. It's not good for the brand. It's not good for the team. You guys are not acting the part. You guys, sorry, I don't like, I don't want to do this. You guys are like my best friends, but you guys need to be cut. It doesn't make sense. Effective immediately, you guys are off the team. You guys are no longer associated with Team Carter, you gotta... No, that's, that's what we have to do, Ryan. I don't want to do this, but you've leave, literally left me guys with no choice. You guys are acting like children out here, doing literally illegal activity. Um, what is... No, just, okay. Like, I'm, I'm done with this. I have a lot of stuff to do to finish this house up. You guys need to go right now. Just kick us out. Just 
Yeah, all right, I'm all right, not, all right. it's not even just go. You guys are not just unbranded. Just get out of here. Okay, dude, we're gone. Like, if there's proof, we're gone. We're gone, dude. We're gone. If there's proof, you find me that proof. Just get out of here. Dude, what just what just happened then? You knew what just happened. We literally just got cut off the team out of nowhere. No, like he he didn't even get a chance to like explain ourselves and. You want to watch it back? I filmed the entire thing. I literally oh, did you? Okay. So that's just really hard to watch back, but yeah. So we kind of just got kicked off of Team RAR and this happened literally an hour ago. Um, we're just trying to kind of cope with it right now because it, it's like getting hit by a, a bus. To have all this happen really unexpectedly is a lot to deal with. You just saw the clip. That's just the raw conversation. He told me to put the camera down and I did, but I didn't stop rolling it because I weirdly kind of got a sense that that was going to happen yeah. while we had the talk. And I mean, I mean, I was just wasn't really expecting that to be honest. I thought he was gonna say, "Hey guys, you know, just cut it out, just blah blah blah, just kind of go back to normal." Because I was kind of expecting that kind of vibe. It's not even like the fact that we're just now whatever being kicked off the team means, but having one of your best friends, yeah, look you in the eyes and tell them that they're done with you, yeah, is awful. What are yeah. we supposed to do? I mean, like, we, what is we, next? I, I, I don't, we just I don't got know. kicked off. We helped build this team up, right? We have put so much time. <laughs> and effort into making this happen and being a part of this group and working with our friends and then just because of some giant misunderstanding to have it all just like yanked out from underneath you is awful. I, I mean, it's, um, it gets scary to be honest. Yeah. Like it's like, you know, everything's gone. Today we're just literally about to go film like it'd be like any or other day. Or it's just a normal right? day um, of this filming and yeah, that's like getting punched um, in the gut. You know, we we're still in the process of trying to figure out who, who it was, but... We thought that we had complete evidence that we didn't do anything wrong, that there was nothing to be held against us. Yeah. We just need him to hear us out, but that's not gonna happen, right? Like you were saying before, he just glosses over all of that. Yeah. And I get, I see his I see his perspective, right? It's true, there are new tenants moving in. Maybe we should not have been going back to the house and yeah, maybe we were glossing over that stuff because we were focused on trying to like get our Name's cleared. It's just like, it's like a, the trust there is just completely gone. Like, what are we supposed to do now? I mean, the only thing that I can think of right now is we just got to keep on, you know, trying to figure out who this person is. What does it even matter? So, though? if we just don't look for this dude again, or whoever it is, that like, works. what then? We're screwed. But, like, if we, if we can find this person, we at least can, maybe Carter wants, like, actual concrete evidence, like, something that's, like, that he can tangibly see or something, there might be hope for us. For me, personally, I'm not gonna stop, because... I mean, you can't stop. It's... I agree, but this is the fact that we have to keep moving on without Team Rar as part of our lives is just the worst thing I've ever heard. Just want to say, again, like... We love all you guys. Um, sorry to you know disappoint you guys like this and like let you all down. This whole thing is just a yeah. But I feel like I'm letting every, I feel like we're letting everybody down, dude. I'm letting everybody who I'm so sorry is it's... invested in us and like this team that we're a part of or <laughs> were a part of. We were a part of. Yeah. I don't know. Yo. All right, guys. You guys have to leave. Already? Okay. I'm Just, only letting you guys hear, do this because I like you guys. Okay. We appreciate it. Thank you. We got to go, guys. Um, love you all.